This is the back side of the daubing, the interior of the cabin. We'll be doing all the daubing on the inside. This is what we've got done from here to the corner to this side of the door. Oh, there's Doug. So these two log walls you'll see that have the daubing already, they were done in just two days time. Windows mudded in. So it looks pretty good. Right, I'll see if you can drive it down here. Okay, trying to run the base of this floor. So the wall is gonna go up right there. And you cut off the end of this board here, like that. Oh, I gotta see, okay. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm stupid. I'm not a videographer. Maybe about an inch. All right, we'll cut the try to get as close as we can. He's in. There you go. He's in. All right. Looks good. That looks good. Okay. You are now the videographer. There you go. We're on. Okay. <clears throat> so, uh, so this side is daubed. Yep. From here to the doorway, and that's thanks to Sterling and Doug and Doug, and I helped with it too. So we all worked on it, and we got it daubed up on this outside. Yep. And we're not going to cover it tonight because the temperature ranges, and there's there's warmth in these logs, and there's warmth in the ground, and the concrete will generate some heat while it dries. So we're thinking we don't need to cover this and heat it tonight. And then tomorrow, we're going to daub that section down there. And we'll go from this side of the door to that side all the way over the corner. Right. About two bags of... About two bags of mix. Two yeah, bags we'll of mix. we to get them picked up first thing in the morning. Yep. And, uh, and then we got that backup bag. So Actually, looking at the... Um, looking at your joints in between the chinking... These are going to we're be a little better off on this side yeah, than we were on the other side. And easier because we can we can we can put the hot board on here and work the mud in. Right. So this is going to work out pretty good. Now, do they know what a hot board is? Let me get one. This is a hot board. Yep. And you put your mud on there and then you work it in with putty knives and then you butter it and that's how that's done. I don't know where it got the name hot board, but that's where the name came from. Anyhow. So that's where we're at. Yep. And we're looking pretty good and we're making hellish good progress. But the temperature is going to drop to uh, below zero after that for about four or five days. So we're going to shift gears. We're going to do other things other than mixing concrete because we right. can't hold it at night. We can't keep it. Making sure our chinking is good, making yeah. sure we can fill in some of these. Right gaps with chicken wire like that and we've got some of this cribbing let's show them the cribbing we're going to pull we're going to start pulling some of this support cribbing i don't think we need it we're going to start taking some of this all off. this interior framework yeah, some of the interior framework i think we're ready to get bye bye on that can't at the at the fireplace opening nope, those can't, have to stay can't jerk them yet but uh some of the other ones we can leave and uh and then we'll come back to daubing as soon as we can as soon as we can get there right but we're making good progress and without this building thank goodness yeah we'd have been out of luck a long time ago two days ago we had what six to eight inches of snow yep. and this morning when we got here this entire roof was covered in covered in snow couldn't see through it and then we got the snow off using I'll give a quick demonstration. Yep. This cool little two by four pole with a pad on the top. And so we just knocked the snow off. Looks rigged, but hey, you don't poke any holes in your plastic. And away the snow goes. Just like that. Just like that. So, yeah. Looks Everything we good. do is rigged, isn't it? Hey, that's how you get the job done. That's how you get the job done. That's <laughs> right. <laughs> so this endeavor right here is to find the slenderest longest
trees, usually cedar, which we are going to use on our roof on the cabin. These were coming from our own property. Hauling the logs back to the pickup drop off point. Okay, on three or one? One. There. Done. Ah. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, nine. And we got two, three, four, at least more laying around. 